Okay, they use a lot of the uh, B complex. The B complex seems to be, uh, and other vitamins seem to be more effective for development of muscle mass. Yeah, they also they also use quite a bit of creatine phosphate especially in the last 10, 15 years. Yeah, they give... Okay. Uh, they're more effective for development of muscle mass and strength. Uh, so they're used quite a bit, you know, extensively uh, to help along with the uh, strength and uh, mass. Okay? No, no. Yes, Okay, there are two uh, methods of commonly using the creatine phosphate. Uh, the first one, they only use it near the end of the cycle when he's getting ready to achieve sports form. Now, sports forum, those of you who weren't here yesterday, uh, well, <laughs> you weren't here, it's, it's really the full adaptation that occurs when you got the most out of that workout or program or exercise. See, they use this concept of sports form. Now you've, you've gotten into sports form. You have now attained everything from that training. You have full adaptation. So they use the creatine phosphate near the end of this cycle, just before achieving full maximum adaptation. Adaptation. The other method that they use is to use the creatine phosphate year round on a regular basis. These are the two methods presently in use. <laughs> Yeah, so this is the big question uh, that many coaches are facing. Which is the best method? The first one where the end of a sports forum or the second one using it year round? Okay. All right. That you have to do. Okay. Now he's saying it would seem that using the creatine phosphate year round would be the best method. Then you can keep gaining, gaining more strength and so on. But he says, but it doesn't work that way. The body eventually gets its fill, so to speak. 
and he will not accept anymore. So then it's just going through the body. It's not, you know, uh, having any more benefit. So it stops. So it's not that good. Then he says also the creatine phosphate takes a big hit on one's health. Once they get to that point, then it's going to take them a long time to recover and get their health back again. He said the creatine phosphate could be very dangerous, you know, to the health. It really knocks them down. And it takes a long time to recover and get over the effects of the creatine phosphate.